Hello folks, um, Vijay, welcome back to Bidding for Tain. Um, I was uh, trying to add uh, some extra, you know, RAM or size to my existing Windows PC, uh, which is uh, HP 14Q series, uh, in particular CS0018TU is the model. Uh, this already had a 4 GB RAM which was sufficient for normal browsing stuff but uh, you know sometimes if you open a more processing intensive uh, applications or more windows uh, you might face a little bit of lag so I thought of um, you know adding an another 8 GB single slot RAM so uh, as you all know um, this uh, laptops uh, and even desktop they come up with certain slots so sometimes you might have two slots or even four slots of uh, RAM that is available inside so which you never know unless uh, if you open it and see it um, so it had a 4 GB single slot uh, RAM so thought of putting in another 8 GB single slot so that makes overall 12 gigs of RAM to this PC or to this laptop uh, so thought of you maybe uh, some of you may find it useful in case if you want to do it of your own or, you know adding some some gigs to your RAM of the existing laptop so let's uh, let's see uh, how to do it So here's the uh, brief spec as you can see uh, from the about option of the PC. Uh, so this is uh, HP 14Q series and you can see 4 GB is the RAM, 3.87 is, is what available for the use and uh, this is what I need to change. So I need to upgrade it to 12 GB. So so I need to get a new 8 GB which I've ordered and I got uh, the RAM. Uh, so I would open it up for the back side of it. There are three, four screws underneath uh, the rubber panel and then there's an outside two of them. So I already opened it so, so you just remove the cover. Uh, this is how it's, it looks from the inside can see the motherboards and fans and other uh, uh, components this is the uh, battery unit and these are the RAM slots uh, the 4 gigs already there and this is the blank part of it where I need to put the another this is the NVMe SSD drive uh, so that is why I don't have uh, HDD uh, disk. I mean, there's no hard drive here because uh, this is SSD 256 gigs I already have. So I can always place another hard disk or SSD hard disk here in this space. So um, just keep it as it is. So all what I need is to put the RAM over here. So I got uh, this crucial. Uh, brand uh, 8 gigabyte ddr4 3200 megahertz uh, you can buy it to 666 that is 2666 megahertz as well and this will only run with the capacity of 2666 on the motherboard as such so it doesn't matter if it is a little higher so this uh, RAM is a little of a broader size uh, as in laptops but otherwise in desktops you get uh, a little slender one so let's uh, you know just uh, switch uh, the sides so that I can put the RAM properly So uh, the slot is pretty much similar as to what is uh, there already, the 4 GB as you can see. So make sure the grooves are, are you know, put in, in place uh, uh, properly and it's uh, 
screws are set properly and you just have to press down and so that the latches of the both sides uh, gets into the groove nicely so put it back and then I'm back uh, opened up uh, I will go to the properties of the uh, this PC um, as you can see in the this PC at the left side of it so let's take the properties and uh, there you go uh, the same thing which we saw earlier it was 4 GB now you can see it is 12 GB with 11.9 GB available for the use so which is uh, pretty much a good space now so it's almost like triple the size 